Hey guys, this is Jess with yet another iPhone game review. So this time I'm going to be going over Mole Kart, which is pretty much a ripoff of Mario Kart. Another thing I will say is, um, since we haven't seen Mario Kart ported to iOS devices, this is a good option to take um, if you're a fan of the game. But uh, you start off with two characters, I believe. Um, you start off with two characters. You can't unlock other characters, but you start off with two. And I believe you start off with two tracks that you can choose from. But uh, instead of having the regular Nintendo characters here, you do have these um, cute little characters. So um, the best character just to start out with is obviously Mole Man. Um, you do have a polar bear, which I can't remember his name. I believe it's like Big White Bear or something like that. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and get into a race. Now, this loading screen is going to take a little while because it does lag a little bit because of the video recording. But this game does lag a little bit at the same time, just in general. Even when I wasn't recording, it was kind of laggy. But, um... I do believe this is a good game. However, um, the controls are a little bit... Um... I believe even if you adjust the sensitivity it's a little bit too sensitive um, even if you adjust the sensitivity like I said um, it still is a little bit over responsive and sometimes at the same time um, it's not very responsive at all um, so this game is a little bit buggy but um, if you want sort of a Mario Kart type game this is the game for you because again this is pretty much a ripoff of the Mario Kart game so uh, as you can see here um, he has various different power-ups various different courses characters um, you'll run into these little blocks and such that are um, the power-ups and whatnot um, but other than it being a little glitchy at times uh, this is pretty much just having Mario Kart on your own device. I believe you can get this in the iTunes store, but if they've already um, taken it down by the time this video is up and running, um, you can get it in Instalus. So if you have a jailbroken device, um, you can check out Instalus and it should be there. But uh, you have various different uh, controls for the driving but I like to stick on the default but if you like various different um, controls instead of the default tilt controls you can change that up in the settings so let's go back to the main menu so you have two different modes you have speed mode and um, pretty much the regular racing mode um, that's what the item mode is you also have multiplayer, but um, what you have to do here is connect to a game. So you can connect to a game that you create or a game that's in your local area on a Wi-Fi connection. So if you have somebody else playing this game on the same Wi-Fi connection, you can do that. Or you can play online if you want to as well. So again, in the settings, um, instead of going from the pause menu in the race, you can also change them here if you don't want to change them mid-race so you can change them by going to settings but uh... that's pretty much it for this game um... let me know what you think about it in the comments below and if you have any questions feel free to ask 